Hey guys, hey, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, then what's up? Welcome. My name is Nassine. I am a full-time working mom of four beautiful kids. I have a floofy, fluffy husky. And if you like this type of video where I show you what I eat during the day and just kind of talk to you about my day, then give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't. Let's get into the video. Okay, so this is the part of the video where I tell you that my battery is dying on my camera because it happens so often. It is, so I'm going to talk fast. For breakfast, I had a one cup of the Green Mountain Vanilla Caramel Cream K-Cup with two tablespoons of half and half, a fourth cup of unsweetened almond milk, and two tablespoons of pure. My second cup of coffee was Bananas Foster by Bones. I love that. It's probably my favorite with the same inside of it and uh drinking the water today somebody mentioned like i said battery somebody mentioned that these two of these could be too much but i'm going based on my body weight it's different for everybody but if you go based on your body weight my recommended amount is of fluids not just water but just like fluids is two of those exactly i think just like a little bit over and if i added my coffee and everything else when i drink about one and a half of these then i'm I'm good. So, and pretty much that's what I drink during the day at work is about one and a half. Um, for lunch today, I brought one of the portable protein packs. This is the turkey, ham, and cheddar. I brought some of these sea salt pecans that came out of the keto crate. This is 22 fat, four total carbs, and only one net carb for 14 pieces so that's a really good way to get some fats in right there if you're gonna have some pecans i don't know if i'll have any of these i just wanted they looked good this morning so i grabbed them and brought them with um you could try keto crate if you're interested the link is always below in the description box you can save 25 percent on your order i also have my electrolytes drops and my magnesium drops from keto chow and a premier protein um, again, I'm going to try, I am going to stop at the store and get mayo and mustard because I didn't have my sandwiches yesterday because I can't eat a dry sandwich. That sounds disgusting. And I also have a hard boiled egg. So that's what I'm going to be having for dinner. We are going to do sandwiches, but I am going to stop at the store first to get the essentials for that. We have plenty of lunch meat and stuff. So, and then tonight, of course I do my grocery pickup order. So we'll be picking that up Saturday evening because I did opt to work for this Saturday. I've worked almost every single, I've worked every Saturday this year, but one, and I'm pretty sure I worked every Saturday in December and November. I've been working a lot of Saturdays, but I need the money. So I'm doing it today. Guess what? What did the scale say? The same thing. Three days in a row. I don't, I don't get it. Only this time it was um, 244.8. Now for the past two days, I've been 244.4. So I'm not sure what's going on. I'm definitely going to have somebody else stand on it and see what's going on and see. I don't know that that's just really confusing to me. It just doesn't make sense. Yesterday I did not write in my planner and track my mood and all of that. I fell asleep, so I didn't do it. And then uh, I also did not track my dinner in my card manager and I'm kicking myself for that because that's all it takes is not doing it. Then you, you suddenly start to slide off of it and I'm trying to be better at that and stay on top of things. So um, because I ate out and I had a burger without a bun and then I had a salad, which I did not eat all of that salad. I ate probably half of that salad. I really wish that there was a way to kind of track things like that. It's hard to track things when you don't make them yourself you know what I mean so that's kind of that kind of sucks but what can you do so today definitely going to track this we'll be tracking my dinner and getting back on that and I will write in my planner and my wellness planner as well and I am freezing so I am going to go and start the car and I will see you guys after work. So I just stopped at Country Market. Look at my hair. And I found the Aunt Millie's bread there. I found the wheat, I found the white, I found the five seed. It's awesome because this place is right next door to me. And a lot of the times Walmart is sold out. And now I have this as an option too. Oh guys, Chalk Zero has a uh, Valentine's Day thing going on and how cute look at this little they sent me this stuff this is um a milk chocolate heart valentine's this is one net carb per serving for the whole thing 
Holy cow, what? Five grams of fat, serving size one piece. Oh, oh no, no, no. There's 11 servings in this one piece, which is about 10 grams is one net carb. I got that. I got some peanut butter cups, white chocolate peanut butter cups. Oh, here, I'll just turn it around. I got this keto spread, this chocolate hazelnut. Oh my God. This is like keto Nutella. There's the macros. Yes. Got two of those. The white chocolate. Oof, man, white chocolate is my favorite. Oh, that's cute. A little raspberry milk chocolate rose. Milk chocolate peanut butter cups. And last but not least, a raspberry white chocolate rose. Oh my God, I love it. Thank you, Chalk Zero, for sending this to me. I love you guys so much. And I, you guys, I have a discount code down below. Always. It's always there. For Wait, is there something else? Oh, no. It is always there for Chalk Zero. Don't mind my messy table. The boys were playing video games. But if you are interested in trying any of this, you guys, go to Chalk Zero. Order it. Use my code. Save some money. This is too cute. And these are amazing. I've never had this. I'm excited to try it. I've had this. I've had this. I've had this. I've not had these. I'm also very excited to try that. And, of course, I haven't had that. But where's milk coming from? Oh, my Zip Fizz. My Zip Fizz has a... Uh... I better clean that up. All right, I gotta go. I gotta clean that up. All right, guys, this is my dinner. I have my sandwich. This has um, one slice of roast beef, four slices of pepperoni, one tomato, some Duke's mayonnaise, some mustard, and two slices of ham. The ham is folded up, so that's why it kind of looks like a lot. I also have one serving of this chopped romaine. I have one serving of banana peppers, two additional slices of pepperoni chopped up on here, and then I used some, um, let me show you. I used this Kraft roasted garlic vinaigrette. This is one carb. And it is really good. I thought it tastes really good.